What is going on everybody? My name is Dayquazy and today I'm giving you guys an episode of Subscriber Advice. If you guys know what Subscriber Advice is, basically a series where you guys, these subscribers, are hopefully soon to be subscribers. Send me a message via Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, whatever you guys want and I get back to you guys within two days. Now today we probably have the best Subscriber Advice I've ever seen in my entire life. This Subscriber Advice is so amazing. There's so many details that I'm going to try to keep it online. So without further ado, here we go. Let's say this girl named Katie goes up to the mountains. She goes with... Her boyfriend and three of his friends. Uh, when they up there, uh, she gets drunk and she has sex with one of the guys. She has an STD now and she doesn't want to tell her boyfriend. Her boyfriend wants to have sex with her, but she's trying to avoid everything at all costs. She wants to know how to solve the mystery of who's the one who had sex with her and also how does she approach her boyfriend. And she came to me for help, which is a smart and dumb idea because I'm going to yell at you real quick. Why? Why? Why would you do this? If for some reason, you know, I don't know exactly what happened, you didn't tell me the email, but I'm going to go off on the whim and say that your boyfriend was like, listen, girl, you know, my boys, they want to go up in the mountain, you know, get that broke bag mountain sort of thing going on, but I don't want to do that, right? I want a girl with me. I want you, my lover, my, my, my other half. Uh, I want you to come up with these mountains with me. You know, we can bond a little bit. You know, you know, kind of get get out of all this, get of our everyday routine. But you know, there may be my boys are coming, so you know, we'll be fine. Maybe you guys all got drunk together. Maybe you got drunk and had sex with your boyfriend. Who 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 knows? Who knows what happened? But you you were pretty pretty uh pretty sure that it was not your boyfriend. So now it comes to the part of where you would figure out who it was. I think you should just go up to them and just tell them because. I, for some reason, I feel like if you're at, like, a camp, like, th these guys were in tents, by the way, just to let you guys know. They weren't, like, in a cabin or anything, so I think that they would probably know. I think everyone knows. I think they're just waiting for you to come out and say it because, you know, they know that you made a mistake. And maybe your boyfriend, you know, maybe he knows, too. Maybe, you know, the bro went to him, like, listen, man, I'm sorry, your girlfriend, she was looking real nice. And they probably fought. Who knows what's going on? But there's a bunch of variables. You need to get to the bottom of this. So, first of all, find the guy or find the group of guys and just say, listen, who was it? You know, you'll find out, of course. Uh, after that, you got to go to your boyfriend and, you know, apologize and apologize and apologize because you know that you didn't want to do this. The alcohol had the better to you, and you, you made a terrible decision. Hopefully, your boyfriend is uh, really, really nice, and he's like, you know what, babe, you know, we, we've... We've been through worse than this. You know, I believe in you. You know, I believe in our relationship. We can work through this. But then you got to drop on them the fact that you have an STD now, and that's going to be really, really hard. <laughs> He's going to be like, oh, God, no, because that that's just bad. But maybe he'll forgive you for that, too, and uh, go to a doctor. That, that's a smart idea. Go to a doctor because um, – Maybe you don't even have a disease. Maybe there's something going on. I don't know. I'm not a female. I don't know how that works. But um, hopefully you get to the bottom of this. And I really want to know a, a follow-up email because this is the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life or heard in my life or read in my life, whatever you guys say. And uh, I hope you get to the bottom of this. But like I said, those steps in that order. Find a, find the guy who did it. Yell at him. You know, whatever. Do whatever you got to do. Um, then go to a clinic. Or actually go to a clinic first. Or go to a doctor first, go to the guy, then go to your boyfriend in that order. So let me know what happens, and I will see you when that does. But all right, guys, basically it for this commentary. If you guys can do me a favor, leave a like right now. That would be greatly appreciated. And if you guys want to be a part of the subscriber advice, just send me a message via Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Gmail, Google+. I don't even use Google+, but you can send Carrier Pigeon. I'll get it eventually. But yes, that is it, guys, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.